down the hatch. <coughs> Fuck, that didn't go, <coughs> didn't quite go as planned. Day today. I'm not exactly sure when or where you guys are going to be seeing this video. It's called tying off a few loose ends for a reason because it's yeah it's the day before I go to New Zealand and my head is absolutely fucking swimming with shit that I need to do. I've got bills. I don't have a family and I still get stressed about shit so I don't know how I'm going to be when I've got kids and a freaking wife and mortgage to pay and all that but anyways today I wasn't meant to work I was meant to have the whole day off cruisy get everything ready but I've been called in to work I could have said no but truth be told I do need as much money as I can before I go away so I'm going to go into work I'm just I got up extra early it's about quarter to eight in the morning and I'm just doing some morning cardio bastard of course Last night, unfortunately, was probably one of the worst days in the last couple of weeks as far as diet goes. Um, I just had a sweet craving that I just could not, could not get rid of. Um, and I suppose it was lucky that I pretty much raided the fucking house for anything sweet. <laughs> and uh, as I'm sure a few of you guys can relate, and I found pretty much everything. And so it totals about three and a half thousand calories for for yesterday. And I mean, I've done that before in the last few weeks, but I was on such a good roll, you know, like waking up every morning feeling leaner. This morning I don't feel as lean. It's just a fact. Uh, so, yeah. But the sad thing is, is that for months, before I actually started taking myself accountable and using my fitness pal for months and months I was feeling this exact way every single morning because I wasn't tracking stuff I was expecting to feel leaner the next morning because I thought that I was in a calories uh, deficit which I wasn't um, so yeah I had all these mixed feelings and it's stupid because if I had have just started writing everything down that I was eating and at that point I was taking things so seriously so I should have started writing things down I don't know why I wasn't like my the, the seriousness of the issue of getting shredded has not changed from the start but all that changed was I really don't know something shifted I no that's right yeah I got the DEXA scan down in Melbourne expecting to be 10% body fat and I got a rude awakening because I hadn't actually lost anything in like the last three months of dieting before I went and got that test so that's what really changed it and um, first things first thing when I got back to Alice Springs I signed up with a coach and got cracking into it and this is where I am now so yeah I'm down at the oval again I just live about two minutes that way and I'll probably do a couple of laps jogging a couple of laps running and a couple of laps walking and we'll see how we go at the end um, but yeah as I said this this video is tying off a few loose ends so I'll show you what they are um, but first of all we'll get this shit done right so we were talking about tying off some loose ends well this desk you see right behind you is meant to be absolutely clean and ever since I've got it it's just got more and more and more shit accumulated I won't go into what it is basically it's all to do with YouTube it's all ideas and video ideas and um, brainstorming and shit like that like you know I've definitely using my brain lately but it's causing a mess so first of all for my first trick I'm going to clean up my desk and make it look the way it's meant to look. And there you have it. 
So, uh, not quite as planned. Um, it's actually the next day, and I've actually got a flight in about an hour. So, uh, I'd better start rushing, actually. Such a procrastinator. That was, that was job number one. This is job number two. What the fuck? Alright, three, two, one. And there we have it guys. It's not perfect by any means. But it's going to be a hell of a lot nicer oh, to come back to that than what I had before. Because that's the last thing you want is to come back to a shitty messy room isn't it all right so got that bag there got my very special piece of equipment here taking the drone to new zealand of course i'm gonna get some wicked footage show you guys where i'm from um got my computer and right now fuck i've got like half an hour spare what else to do when you got half an hour than to go and smash some weights. I'm gonna hit some shoulders quickly, get a good pump, come home, and then uh, I'll be off to the airport. So, yeah. There's actually a few things that I was meant to do this morning that I'm not gonna be able to do. I condensed, <laughs> I condensed all of those pieces of um, paper that you saw earlier into this one list, and I've done six out of the 10 things that I've got to do this morning. Um, not least of which, making this video. <laughs> so, yeah, not going to be able to get everything done, but hey, that's just the way it is. And, uh, I'm off to the gym now. Might get some footage. Let's go smash some fucking delts. Make some gains. My Got like 20 minutes. I'm going to have to superset the fuck out of this workout. in two weeks. Huh. Bit heavier than I remember. Would you look at the delt? Oh, I'm pumped. 20 minutes. Damn. All right. Flatmate is meeting me at home. He's gonna give me a lift to the airport. So I better uh, better get home. 